내가 깨어난 것이냐 고약한 것들 화장아 화장아 불났다 불 엄마 샤오야 빨리 무다 무자 Hi welcome back from ghostly apparitions haunting ancient palaces to unsettling explorations of human psyche gone awry this year's offerings shine a spotlight on the best Korean horror movies of 2024 only 8.3% are subscribed to the channel. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to support the channel. Number 10, Tarot. Seven eerie stories focused on a doomed tarot deck, with each narrative highlighting the misfortunes of those impacted by its sinister influence as the cards pass from one person to another, unleashing otherworldly horrors on their unwitting possessors. Tarot has a 5.1 rating in IMDb. Number 9. The Sin Young has been selected to take on the leading role in an avant-garde art film focused on her dance studies. Together with her college friend Che Yun, they execute geometric dance sequences as part of a shamanic ritual under the direction of the film's director. However, everything changes when a crew member unexpectedly tumbles from the rooftop, but their seemingly inert body starts to stir and awaken. The Sin has a 5.3 rating in IMDb. <laughs> Number 8. Devil's Stay A cardiologist questions the death of his daughter following an exorcism convinced her heart is still pulsating. During her three-day wake, he and a clergyman contend over the reality, both striving to validate their beliefs while possibly rescuing her life. Devil's Stay has a 5.8 rating in IMDb. <laughs> Number 7. Respati. A dreadful event took place in Yogyakarta. The victims were discovered suspended upside down. The identity of the murderer remains a mystery. My name is Respati. I possess an unusual talent. I can enter someone's dream simply by touching their skin. I had become accustomed to this ability until I encountered Wulan, whose dreams I could not access. It was through Wulan that I learned I was a dream explorer. She also revealed to me that all the homicide cases were intricately linked to my abilities. Respotty has a 5.9 rating in IMDb. Number 6. The Killers. A weary man stirs awake in a bar next to a bartender who will irrevocably alter his existence as he discovers more about her. Three criminals have partially succeeded in abducting their prey yet their mission ultimately appears to be at a standstill. In the late 1970s, an enigmatic woman operates a bar where a perilous circumstance will impact everyone's lives. Two assassins are on the hunt for their unidentified target, who appears at a diner precisely at 6 o'clock every day. Four exceptionally gifted Korean filmmakers, four captivating cinematic perspectives, four remarkable tales centered around contract killers, the Killers has a 6.0 rating in IMDb. <laughs> Number 5. Marnie. The story of We We Gomble. Rahayu and her two kids, Anissa and Anne, relocated to a village with a sinister past. One day, um, and vanished under mysterious circumstances after being abducted by a spirit. It was revealed that Anne had been taken by We We Gomble, a terrifying ghost who was once known as Marnie. Marnie had been a stunning herbalist, but her life took a dreadful turn when she fell victim to rape and became pregnant. The villagers cast her and her infant out of the community. This ordeal drove Marnie to seek vengeance by transforming into We We Gomble. Marnie, the story of We We Gomble, has a 6.0 rating in IMDb. Number 4. Handsome Guys 
The tale revolves around a woman in a mountain lodge in Gangwon province who becomes overtaken by a malevolent force, prompting a priest to intervene. After 66 years and six months, childhood friends Sang Gu and Jay Pyle acquire the lodge, only for Mai Na to become entangled with them during a trip. The film chronicles the horrifying events that befall the group and is noted for focusing on the satanic goat-headed entity Baphomet. Handsome Guys has a 6.5 rating in IMDb. Number 3. Exuma After enduring a series of paranormal occurrences, an affluent family in La calls upon a young, promising shaman couple, Hua Rim and Bong Gil, to rescue their newborn. Upon their arrival, Hua Rim detects the dark presence of an ancestor that has attached itself to the family in what is termed a grave calling. To excavate the grave and free the ancestor, Warim enlists the aid of renowned geomancer Sang Diok and mortician Young Jun. Unfortunately for them, the quartet discovers that the grave is located in a suspicious area of a remote village in Korea. Oblivious to the repercussions, they proceed with the exhumation, releasing a sinister force that had been buried below. Exuma has a 6.9 rating in IMDb. Number 2. Hidden Face Seong Jin is a conductor overseeing an orchestra. He is engaged to Su Yeon, a cellist and member of his ensemble. One day, Su Yeon vanishes, leaving a video message behind. Seong Jin feels anguish over her abrupt absence. Concurrently, he finds himself drawn to Mai Ju, who has taken Su Yeon's place in the orchestra. On a stormy night, Seong Jin and Miju become entangled in each other's longing and commit an unforgivable act in So Yeon's home. Meanwhile, Su Yeon, believed to be missing, is confined to a hidden room within her house. She uncovers the truths concealed behind the faces surrounding her. Hidden Face has a 7.3 rating in IMDb. What, what, what? If you want to watch series like Alchemy of Souls, Revenge of Others, or The First Responders, but they are not available in your country due to geographical restrictions, you are in luck. NordVPN can help you with this problem. Right now, NordVPN is offering a mega discount plus four free months with the exclusive link that is in the description. If you want to access thousands of series from all over the world on your favorite streaming platforms like Netflix, Prime Video, or Hulu, NordVPN is the perfect solution and you will surely be satisfied, and if you are not, they offer you 30 days to make a return and you will get all your money back. Now, let's get back to the video. Number 1. Tabusan Dosa Wenning, a mother, faced a heartbreaking ordeal when her 11-year-old daughter Nirmala vanished in a motorcycle accident on a bridge. The incident also took the life of Utia, Wenning's mother. She carries heavy guilt over her mother's death and her child's fate in the river, but she holds on to the belief that Nirmala is still alive. Tirta, a podcaster focused on mysteries, is eager to share Wenning's sorrowful story. However, her involvement leads Tirta to unearth troubling aspects of Wenning's history that contributed to Nirmala's disappearance. With relentless determination and faith, Wenning searches for Nirmala, reaching out to Tetsuya, a researcher from Japan, for assistance. She also seeks aid from Emba Goa, an enigmatic shaman. Yet during her quest, Wenning is continually haunted by the apparition of Yudiya. Will Wenning find her way back to Nirmala? Tibu Sendosa has a 7.4 rating in IMDb. <laughs> Do you like this video? Check others' videos here and subscribe to be notified about our most recent videos. See you next time. Goodbye.